Shorty making plans, I don't say the dates, nah Before you swallow me, better say your grace, uh But out the VIP, we just need a space, uh Hello everyone! My name is Victoria Nicole and welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing this spring slash Easter makeup look. It's very light, simple, but a bit colorful as well. And I'm just excited to bring to you this little it's a little different than what i'm used to because there's like this little curve that i was very excited to work with today and of course my beautiful coco Marilyn lashes that i love so much i swear if i can sleep in these lashes i will like it's ugh, i love them so much <laughs> so enough of me rambling on about my lashes. Let's bring to you the video. Yeah, yeah. Hello, my babes. Now we are bringing you the beautiful Star Crushed Minerals in Cosmic Rays. This is a gorgeous yellow shade, and I am using a loose pigment i will have a, a video specifically explaining how i apply these loose pigments in detail now the next shade is star crushed minerals in life is peachy this is like a gorgeous kind of peachy light peachy shade and i first apply it at the end of my eye and then i kind of bring it forward and uh, apply it right at the crease to kind of add a little bit of definition to my crease because since my eyes are a little bit more uh, oval I don't have such a defined crease so I like to define it a little bit more with some color now you see me go back in with cosmic rays I will go back and forth with cosmic rays and life is peachy just to make sure the blend looks nice and seamless with life is peachy i am using the makeup shack brush in t36 and with cosmic rays i am using mainly the makeup shack brush in t12 so i will go through between these brushes as you can see they are both white brushes with kind of like a gold on top and they blend very beautifully you can't see here but i am using tart shape tape in light neutral to cut the crease using my real techniques detailer brush I always create the cut crease above my actual crease to make my eyes look bigger. Now I'm using my Star Crushed Minerals in White Lightning to set the cut crease. And this is going to be my base for the cut crease. By the way, loves, the brush that I am using is an e.l.f. eyeshadow brush. Now I will be using Luminous Lava in Star Crush Minerals to define the crease using the Morphe M515 brush. Going back in with Life is Peachy with the Makeup Shack T36 brush and again with the Luminous Lava. I will be going back and forth between Luminous Lava, Life is Peachy, and Cosmic Rays just to make sure that blend comes out nicely. As you can see, I am doing more of an oval type shape, and this is to be a little bit more creative. Oh, 
Now I'm using a pencil brush, which is Makeup Shack's T8 in Cosmic Rays. And again, with the T12 Makeup Shack in Cosmic Rays as well to make that blend come out. I love blending. If you see, I will really blend my life away. Well, not my life away. I will blend my life back into existence <laughs> if you want it a little bit more positive. Now, adding a little bit more definition back into the cut crease because sometimes while blending, it will lose its definition. And making sure it's so sharp and beautiful. And back to that ovaly shape that I need it to be. Ballin, ballin, ballin. I know I can't sing, but I'm gonna try anyways. <laughs> ballin. Setting that cut crease again with White Lightning by Star Crushed Minerals because I am trying to make it as bright and white as humanly possible. Bringing that luminous lava definition back into my cut crease with that ovaly shape to make it a little, you know, unique. <laughs> As you can say, okay, loves, let's speed this up a little bit. Now I'm using the Makeup Shack T8 pencil brush using Star Crushed Minerals Cosmic Rays as my lower lash line eyeshadow. I always try to add a lower lash line. Maybe I won't do it as dark, but I will always add a little bit of color under my lash line. Now loves, I'm so excited to use NYX pigment in 07, which is called Brighten Up. Oh my god, on the inner corners, it looks gorgeous. Now of course, to wipe off my translucent powder with the Too Faced Mr. Right brush. I love this brush to take off powder. This is the only brush I will use to take off translucent powder off of my face. And now going in with the incredible, gorgeous Orf Ofra Cosmetics in Rodeo Drive. This is my life. You have no idea. And I'm using the Morphe E18 brush to apply this and the Morphe M501 brush to do my actual highlight. So the little pencil brush is the E18, the bigger brush is the M501, both by Morphe. I live by these highlight brushes. Now I'm going in with my favorite liner, which is stripped down by MAC Cosmetics. This is the perfect liner for a new, any nude color that I do on my lips. This is the liner I use because it, it accents my lips perfectly and just so beautifully. Shorty 
Shorty making plans, I don't say the dates, nah. Before you swallow me, better say your grace, uh, uh, but after VIP. So this is an old ride or die that I picked up again and fell in love with all over again. This is Ofra Cosmetics San Paulo. It is such a beautiful nude. I love it with my shade of lips. And I used to wear it all the time. And now I picked it up again and I don't know if I'm going to set it down. I thought I had the big portion, but I think I only have the sample size. <laughs> so, this is my spring slash Easter makeup look. I know it's very simple, light colors, but I tried this on yesterday and it came out a disaster. So I decided to keep it a little bit more simple just to, I don't know, I just to make it nice and sweet, you know, because I feel like spring, it's very like, <coughs> Oh my god, sorry. Spring is very pastel. Easter is very. Like, every time I think of spring and Easter, I think of pastel colors. And yesterday I tried to do a whole bunch of pastels and it turned up into a disaster. And I did it only on one eye. I didn't even film the other eye. I didn't even want to because it was just disastrous. But. This one came out beautifully and so simple and I hope you guys enjoy it and like it because it was just a mess yesterday. So, and I mean it looks very light spring. I can't say colorful, but there is like kind of like this little sunset tone to it. Sunflower sunset. You know the drill. So if you like this video, like, comment down below what type of looks you want me to do. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, I don't know if the notification bell really works or not, but hey, you can try it out if you want. And yeah, love you guys. Bye.